Okay. I just love like good hot sex. I okay. love like guys in their twenties. I get rough with a lot of them. <laughs> okay. I like that though. I love like face sitting and like smothering them. Oh. kind of a young impressionable girl you were dancing in Virginia and so did one of these women kind of like babe you can come and do this with me or take Mm, you under their wing not really I wish I am just I started googling and finding agents and then next thing I knew I was coming out to LA and then I moved out here two months later wow yeah it was and how old were you I was 20 at the time and then I did my very first scene on my 21st birthday. Wow. July 11th, 2006. And what was it? Oh my gosh, it was for this website See Her Squirt and oh I was like God. and I was like I am not a squirter. I think my agent sent me to like the wrong set <laughs> and they were like, "Oh no, 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 no. Like we fake it, don't worry." And I was like how do you fake this? And they were like, you know, we stick a douche yeah. bottle to fill it up yeah. with warm water and then he'll just put his dick there and you just push it out. And I was like, oh, I can easily do this. Oh, and of course. I'm about at that point for myself. We just right? learned that yeah. the other day. We learned from mm-hmm. Kaylee. Kaylee Gunner, yeah. She I'm taught us turkey how. Turkey the tricks. Her. Yeah, the turkey based. Yeah. I've been trying to squirt for so long and all I needed to do was just mosey on into my kitchen. There <laughs> drink a bunch of Pedialyte. <laughs> but a cougar definition by the urban dictionaries ever so um eloquent definition Mm -hmm. cougar is a woman who dates younger men right technically it's a cougar is a woman that dates men 10 years younger so i'm 37 (laughs) 20 so and i'm usually with i think the guy today that i was working with was like 23 whoa yeah Yeah. <laughs> okay. So yeah, we definitely fit that. You okay, made so you're it. 37. Yep. I'm 37 too, and I am currently dating somebody 10 years younger. Amazing. Yes. I love it. It has mm. been. I All love right. it. Yeah, highly recommend, y'all. I love younger men. This is my first younger man. Even, That's your first rodeo. Yeah. <laughs> even when I was younger, I always dated older. I always thought like, ooh, an older boy is so is cool and he can teach me things. Oh but, gosh, no. Yeah. <laughs> This is my first time. I'm I'm really enjoying it. Is this something how now is this something that you oh you always dated younger men even before you did porn? Or tell us a little bit about this. I recently got into it about five years ago. I was actually no, it was about yeah, five years ago. Mm-hmm. Um, just playing a lot of like the MILF and cougar role in the industry. And then I started dating a guy that was 10 years younger okay, than me. In real he, life. Yes. Okay. He was 23. I was 33, but he was very mature. He wasn't a punk. Had his shit together. And um, it just worked. I mean, he was a little immature with a few things. And then, but um, it was great. I loved Mm -hmm. it. I always feel that older men, like they just look at me like, oh, well, when are you going to get out of this little phase of shooting OnlyFans? And Mm -hmm. I'm like, I've been in the industry almost 17 years. Wow. Yeah. Like versus younger men are like, rock on, like do your thing. Who makes the names of porn video of like, who names them? Oh my gosh. I have no idea. (laughs) That's a really good question. It's like (laughs) the weird, like they do takes like modifications of normal movies. Right. Mm -hmm. Like Jingle Balls or something. (laughs) I feel like (laughs) Kayla would be good at that. I want to do that. I I have no creativity when it comes to stuff like that. I'm like, somebody just write it for me. (laughs) Even my Instagram captions, I'm like, somebody write this for me. (laughs) Sometimes sometimes it is kind of like a lot. I just have a theme for mine (laughs) where I just write, like I think of a pet peeve of mine Mm -hmm. every time. And then I just say good morning to everyone except, yeah, I and like then that. I write something that bothers me. <laughs> I like, like it. If you don't like put your, go- your shopping cart back in the corral, mm. you know, if you're doing lawn work before 7 a.m., oh. things like that, mm. that oh everyone gosh. hates. Yep. Mm-hmm. If you hold the door for someone for too long, and then they have to scurry to get through the door. Mm. <laughs> so, okay. not sexy, but... Okay. All right. No scurrying. Anyways, if no anybody's scurrying. looking for somebody to write... Their Kayla, the names of like their Pornhub videos mm. or their films. <laughs> I'm gonna start DMing yeah, you. Let you me go. know. <laughs> I like good. to do it. I just feel like young guys are just fun. Like they don't care. They're just gonna go with the flow and just do whatever. Yeah. And I love it. What, like, what do they like most about you? They just they love the experience, just being with an older woman that knows her body and what I like, and just taking charge. Mm. I mean, that's what I love doing. So with your them. body. 
Oh, yeah. What's going on with this? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I get rough with a lot of them. <laughs> okay. I like that, though. I love, like, face-sitting and, like, smothering them. Oh. And that's, like, the thing that's different that I love outside of porn is I call it smother sex. Okay. Like, I'm smothering them and, like, mm. they're smothering me and I'm just, like, bring it on. Okay, wait. I so, I, when you're saying you're smothering them, I imagine you sitting on top of their face. Oh, yes. And you're All smothering them. Yeah, I know. You got a All lot of juicy booty. ass. Yeah. Uh -huh. All this juicy booty on oh. them. And so, you're on top smothering them, but how are they smothering you? Are you getting oh, face fucked? No, just, like, if we're missionary and stuff, mm -hmm like that and we're just making out and just oh just breathing in like <laughs> all of it her all that good testosterone I did. <laughs> she left the building for a moment because <laughs> it's like we don't get that on set mm -hmm. you know on set it's not about our orgasm we're opening up and arching and you know giving it to the viewer mm -hmm. so they can get off it's mm -hmm. like I love that smother sex. Yeah, Aww. where they're re you're like really very intimate. Yeah. yeah, I love that. I'm holding out for anal. I've never done that. Wow. I wanted. To, I know all this. You ass, want to? I yeah. Know. My fans are driving me insane. I just it's something that I'm just not really into in my personal mm -hmm. life to start doing it. But if I do it first, it's going to be for my OnlyFans. So I'm going to sell it to like a bigger company. Yeah, yeah. yeah. absolutely. You absolutely should. Yeah. If mm. you decide, yeah. if you decide, if or when you decide, yeah. all the parts have to align. Like I have to get the right guy mm -hmm. and like everything, the right script and, mm -hmm. and then I'll do it. Okay. <laughs> So you don't like it, though, normal? No, I don't do it at home. It's not my thing. Same. Coconut oil. <laughs> Coconut oil. Yes. No, and people talk about it, and they all everyone talks about it like, yeah, you got to really gear yourself up, and you got to have so much lube, and you got to maybe have a couple drinks. <laughs> yeah, and then you a couple gotta, drinks. And you got to... <laughs> get used to the size and then once it's in it hurts but then you get used to it eventually well, and like, then it's a rough I'm like what the fuck like, once you so get past that first little part yes. then it's like going into like a black hole yes. like men don't feel anything I think it's more of like an ego thing like oh you it know is. I fucked her ass exactly. and I'm like wait uh, yeah. bro <laughs> so you're like, here to feel your ego yeah, it's yeah. A, I think I think it is definitely like just I've had all her holes I'm, <laughs> oh I'm my God. the strongest <laughs> her holes <laughs> The I'm the winner of the holes. <laughs> holes. The winner of the holes. Uh, <laughs> do you like like aggressive, dirty talk? Yeah, I love that. Ooh, give give it right back to him. <laughs> What's the tip off when you're like, okay, no, that's a porn move. We're not doing that. Oh my god, when they stand up in the bed, like if we're like to stand up for me to start blowing them, I'm like, uh, no, no, no. no. <laughs> like, I mean, I literally had a guy one time like just stand up on my bed, so I'm like kneeling, like, going at him. And I was just kind of like, this is, like, what I would do, like, in a scene. Right. I'm like, just lay there. You don't need to stand yeah. up and Eiffel Tower me. Oh, yeah. no. like, I'm good. You're like, you're going to fall. Yeah. I'm sucking your dick. Uh, I am very good at this. You are going to fall. You're going to break your back. Yeah, like, We're not going to be able to finish. I was like, if you need to, like, get off the bed and stand, and then I'll, like, bend down, then you get the view of my booty. But I was like, what are you doing? Stand on the bed. You're going to hit my chandelier. That would be so funny to like, <laughs> sit down. Down, motherfucker. What are you doing? I probably did say that to him. <laughs> Calm He's down. Like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry, Miss Ryan. Like, yeah. Sorry, Miss Ryan. <laughs> I love it when they call me Miss Ryan. Ooh. I love that. I wow. think it's, I don't know. It's so cute. Oh, <laughs> okay. I, that's kind of hot, though, because it's kind of like respect. Yeah. Yeah. I know. I love it. I was like, I told my date, I was like, if you're going to drink with me, I only drink tequila. Yeah. And he was like, he was like, Oh, tequila. And I was like, I love tequila. Oh, is so he I just... in his vodka age? Yes. Yeah. Vodka is All an age. It is an age. It yeah. is. And then you get, I had that too. And I was like disgusted by tequila. Mm -hmm. And then uh, now I think vodka is like rubbing alcohol, disgusting. Me too. And mm -hmm. I love tequila. But then I wonder if I'm going to have a whiskey face. Because <laughs> I hate whiskey. <laughs> when yeah. you're 40. But when I'm 40, like yeah. in 10 years, am I going to like whiskey? I don't know. We, you never know. We'll, we'll, we'll let you know. know. What? Yeah, well, you know. I know in a couple of years. <laughs> yeah. And then oh older, I just drink wine and Xanax, I yeah. think. It's <laughs> like when I'm 50. Is that the truth? Yeah, once well, you get married, then you can start okay, having okay, wine okay. and Xanax. Yeah. yeah. All right, I'll start when I get home. <laughs> <laughs> you have to be cleaning. Don't forget to pop a bar. Oh, of course. Start cleaning. <laughs> Vacuuming. Start cleaning the house. House. <laughs> Smoking a cigarette. <laughs> looking crazy. Yeah. I'm not far off. 